So this morning I'm in Patapsco Valley State Park. I'm gonna be doing the Liberty Dam Trail. There's a small pull off here. There's like no parking signs everywhere, but it does say you can park in the designated areas, which is just like three spots next to my car. So we're gonna start heading down this access road, it looks like. Um, it's under two miles, so it shouldn't be a long hike. The reviews online said uh, get here early or you won't get a parking spot. So it's 7 a.m. Eastern Sunday. So I can do this hike and then get to Mass at 10. So two reasons I like hiking early is you can beat the crowd. You can have the hike to yourself. And you usually don't have to worry about parking or a parking space. So I always try to if it's a popular hike, I always try to start at 8 a.m. or earlier. And that seems to work in terms of parking and avoiding the crowds. So it looks like we're gonna stop, go on the road, and gonna follow this trail. Looks like a yellow marker is on this tree up here. <sighs> Holy skunk cabbage. There's a wetland of some sort down there. And there's a big rock there and here we are coming up on liberty dam it is not running so we're not going to get any water picks but it's still just cool to go and check it out see what it looks like and here we are at the base Liberty Dam. It would be a lot more interesting if it was flowing, but nothing we can do. So let's climb these rocks here. Let's see what the other side looks like. So here I am about as close as you can get right in front of it. And here it is from the last angle, so not that bad of a hike. Um, relatively flat, under two miles. I think it's like 1.7, 1.8. So if you're ever in the area, check it out. It's a, yeah, like I said, I wish it was flowing, but nothing I can do about that.